India's capital, New Delhi, has recorded its first heat-related fatality this year. Local media reported on Thursday that a 40-year-old labourer died of heat stroke. Parts of northwest and central India have been experiencing severe heatwave conditions for weeks. Environmental health expert Amruta Norisama. Heatwaves are particularly problematic if they last for a longer period of time, in addition to the intensity. So usually the first day of extreme heat is a problem for human health, but especially the second and later days of extreme heat are additionally difficult because then the human body doesn't have time to recuperate as an extreme heat period extends. New measures were taken on Wednesday to ensure laborers are better protected against the heat, including providing water and shaded areas at construction sites and granting them paid leave from noon to 3 p.m. Delhi recorded a temperature of 96.8 degrees Fahrenheit, which felt like 100 degrees Fahrenheit, according to India's weather department. It has predicted heat wave to severe heat wave conditions over northwest and central India will begin reducing gradually from Thursday. However, public health experts say that they expect heat related hospitalizations and mortalities could continue in coming days. So I think mortalities will continue to rise. Um, number of heat related mortalities will continue to grow. Um, we might expect to see some of the more um, strong indicators of longer term heat related illness. Summer temperatures often peak during May in India, but the India Meteorological Department predicted seven to 10 heat wave days in Northwestern regions this month, compared with the usual two to three days. This was largely due to fewer non-monsoon thunder showers and an active but weakening El Nino, it said.